welcome youtubers to this um, this uh, short video I um, I just did a hopefully fantastic thing I bought myself an airbrush I have never airbrushed anything before so I'm completely new to it um, this is the uh, box I want to unbox it with you I must admit I had I have cheated a bit because I had to to check when I received the box that all the components went uh, when all the uh, uh, that the box contained all the stuff that I bought so I have actually opened it and I have checked it but I want to show you what you get when you buy a uh, generic basic air compressor uh, including uh, some airbrushes um, since I'm very new to it, this uh, box is nothing fancy. Um, oh, it, the box is definitely not something fancy, but the, what it contains is nothing particular fancy. It's just a very generic, very basic uh, compressor and three no-name uh, Airbrushes bought from a online store called uh, VitaXL.com, uh, and I must admit I was a bit anxious when I bought it because I have never bought from them before, and I had no idea how they were going, what they were going to deliver at what speed. Uh, being in Europe, um, it was the cheapest. Uh, the cheapest solution that I could get. I will post a link below to the exact set. Exact set. Uh, I was told, and and my I had to men mention that my goal was to keep it on as low budget for starters as possible. So I was told by various sources that I should focus on two things, um, either a compressor with an air tank and or a decent airbrush and uh, if i want to buy an an compressor with with an air tank and a decent airbrush it, uh, it kind of gets semi expensive and um, that's not what i wanted i want to have it super not super uh, cheap, but as cheap as possible within some, and still making some sense. So my focus was primary to buy a compressor with an air tank and then get what I, what was within the package of airbrushes because an airbrush is somewhat cheaper to upgrade and buy additionally than a complete air tank. Right, so this is the set I bought um, from VitaXL, and uh, I think we should just uh, open the box and see what you get when you buy this stuff. I don't know if you can see it. You can. Yeah. So what you get is a lot of boxes, and and the first box that you get here is the is some. Uh, there's some small um, I don't know if we can open this can we please yeah there we go and so do so what what you get here in the first box this what did it do? Didn't I drop something? I did. There it was. The first thing you get is something uh, airbrush coupler. I have no idea what that is. Is that something where you just put it down easily and just disconnect it. I think so. So I have a 
quicker time just plugging it into the hose and disconnecting it. I'm not sure. Um, as I said, I've never tried this before. And then there's a this little fella. Um, I don't know if this is a converter or something. Hmm. A mini filter. Oh, that's for con for uh, yeah for uh, collecting the moist. I think before it goes into the um, into the airbrush. Then there's this adapter, so you can. Uh, I would assume you can plug it into the compressor, and then you can connect three airbrushes to the same air hose or not uh, to the same uh, output and then there's these um, I would assume that they are also some kind of adapters yeah yeah I'm not even sure that I'm going to use all of these um, various connectors but uh, I'll figure that out once I connect it it won't be in this video it's just to show what's in the boxes then I have this box and uh, it's a quite heavy box and this box contains oh, a cleaning pot So I get this cleaning pot with some some filters in it and the holder and it, I don't know what's it called pipette yeah so that's uh, that's neat. It's not the Vallejo, it's, I don't know what brand this is, but it's, it's nice, it's um, definitely going to be useful. Then we have this small box, and this small box is what it is a oh it's the uh, the airbrush holder I think yeah it is so you have this this stand for the airbrushes and you can have up to four that's with the I would assume that it would be heavier but um, super fantastic and it, it seems to fit kind of like it's, it's generic so it would fit I would well, I would assume that it will fit all airbrushes or close to all Then we have this small box and this small box is the first airbrush and it's a siphon feed airbrush as you can see. Uh, oh yeah, let's go this way because then it's much easier for you to see. And it's nothing special, it's it's plastic all the way. And it's again I'm no I have never never touched this before, so I don't know I don't even know what it's called, this type of feed into the airbrush, but um 
just you know the the feel of it this seems very cheap but uh, and I have kind of read that this is definitely not the way we I want to go with the with the uh, siphon feed but um, but in terms of painting painting um, a painting landscape and stuff then I suppose it will do again at a later point if I find it if a uh, if it get it gets interesting to, to paint with an airbrush this is definitely uh, something that can be upgraded and put away but uh, yeah nice to have then we have the next box which is again a small box as you can see and this is also a airbrush and this is also a seven feet a bit uh, quite a bit heavier and again a no name uh, airbrush but this is metal and you can definitely tell by the weight of it and uh, you have a hose you have I don't know what this is this is something that you can hang the airbrush I don't know but you have the option of either uh, connect these glasses or a cup obviously beneath the airbrush and the hose I have no idea how this works is it this is this way a bit I would imagine that you have to fill this cup up quite a lot and have a lot of uh, waste since the if you can see how far up the air the, the, the sucking the, I don't know the hole where it's going to suck up the uh, the paint is then I would assume that there should be a lot of paint in this but it's a um, dual action uh, I don't know what the, uh, the plastic was but at least this is dual action and and a Again, I have never held an airbrush before, so I have no idea whether how this is comparing compared to to uh, more expensive airbrushes. I hope I will find out at a later point, but uh, it's not that bad, at least not for from a beginner's point of view. Uh, yeah. You then have we have this box and this box is actually what I think I'm going to use the most it's the again no name but this is the airbrush that I that I'm going to use for the uh, for the painting of my minis and it's also a metal thing with a dual action and there's this level where you can control how far back the uh, the trigger has to go and I, I haven't even investigated what needle is on uh, is in the airbrush, but at least I got I got two spare needles. Oh, nice! A I don't know if you can see it. A point five needle, and what was this? It was a 
0.2 needle so that's that's fine so I don't know what's I don't even know how this works and how detailed you can get with a 0.5 and 0.2 needle and then you got this a bit different quality I don't know if this thick air hose will be better quality than the the small uh, hoses that you that I was in the uh, other on the other airbrushes then I got this this nozzle 0.5 millimeter and the 0.2 millimeter yeah a pipette and this is uh, the the um, the tool for changing it I think yeah but um, yeah fine and then we have the most important part which is this fella and this is the as you can see this is the airbrush that you get with the uh, tank and let me see if I can get this up for you guys so this is the, um, let me just, there we go, this is the, uh, the airbrush, no, this is the, um, the compressor, as you can see it has this, this uh, 3 liters tank, the compressor itself, and of course the, uh, the gauge and the moisture collector and of course to setting the PSI on off button yeah but this is what you uh, what you get from the um, Vita XL bundle uh, as I said, the me buying this set was primarily to buy this fella, the compressor with the tank. All the other parts were were something that kind of just went with. But I think it's a it's a it's a good deal. Uh, I'm looking forward to test it. It's not going to be in this video, but. Uh, I hope you enjoyed looking at the video and see what you actually get in the package from Vita. Um, yeah, see you on the next video. Hopefully, it's going to be a fun journey into the uh, airbrushing, the world of airbrushing. But um, have a fantastic day. Talk to you later.